Hi, I'd like to ask a question concerning parental authority. So uh, during the first few years of a child's life, you obviously need some sort of authority to make sure they develop in the right way. Um, and as a society, we have determined the age of 18 to be the legal age of um, independence. So um, at what point objectively do you think that the child is able to make his own rational decisions apart from the parent's authority and independent from that? Is it age 18 or is it some other age? Well, I think the law has to define an age. And then I would say that a child who, who thinks that at 15 or 16 or 17 they are in a position to make their own decisions and are willing to bear the consequences of that, and their parent is objecting, let's say, but they're willing to provide for themselves, and then they would have to appeal to a court and, and get and, and show that, right? And, and, and it would be up to a court to make that decision. I don't think it's a uniform age for everybody, but the, the law has to, has to make a an age, uh, uh, you know, by which, by which it's, it's standardized. And then you can have exceptions, but you have to prove you're an exception. So is parental authority morally justified until that age, or are there exceptions in which the child can make his own independent? Well, it depends by what you mean, parental authority, and over what. Uh, suddenly, when a child is very, very young, right, uh, parents have to decide pretty much everything that the child does, and they have no realm. But uh, when we talk about moral, right, you, you talked about morality, certainly as a child grows older, it is part of the responsibility of the parent to let the child have a broader and broader realm in which we, they make the decisions, whether it's which toy to buy. I didn't ask my one-year-old what toy they wanted, because that would have meant nothing, right? There was nobody to communicate with in that sense. But by the time they were five, they chose their toys, right? Or most of their toys, or some of their toys, or whatever. So you, you've got to broaden the scope in which they make the, but you are still the final authority until they reach legal age. That is your responsibility. And I would think that in broadening the authority, you've got to be paying attention to this kid, right? Some of your, let's say you have a few different children, right? Some of them might be much more mature and able to make certain decisions on their own at the age of 12 than at the age of, well, now his brother, he needs more oversight. You know, no, we can't trust him to do this or have that night at home alone or whatever. So you've got to, be, so I don't think there's a single, this is the moral age, you know. Now, as a parent, and I would think this is one of the very difficult kinds of decisions is how much, free, you know, you want to be giving them more and more autonomy responsibly though and again heedful of well no this kid is different from my old my first child so i need to pay attention so yeah okay thank you